guys, so today I want to film my nail polish favorites because I forgot to put that in my last video. And this is just my favorite like spring nail polishes. And so let's get started. Okay, so I tried organizing them by like brand. And so first we have the Sally Hansen Instant Dry uh, Company, I guess you would call it. And this one is a mint spirit. And I'm not really sure why this is my favorite spring color. Oh, and ignore my horrible nail painting. I just painted them and I can't paint my nails very well. And, um, but it is the nail color that I actually have on right now. And it's drying right now. And so let me do a swatch for you guys. So here is the swatch and it actually kind of dries a little bit more lighter than what it looks like wet. And so... It will kind of turn a little bit more of a spring green when it dries, but not very much. It's still very minty, and I just love this color for the spring. Okay, so next from the Sally Hansen Instant Dry Collection is this Lightning. And I love this color, and um, it's kind of like a cheap version um, of the Sally Hansen... I can't remember what it's called, but it's like one of those like extreme wear ones. Sydney it Be As Me got it in her shopping haul. I'm not sure if that video is up yet, but she has that one. Um, and I just like it because it's this wonderful like spring yellowy color. And so let me do a swap for you guys. And it dries the same color that it has like in the bottle, unlike that last one. I love this color, not on my fingertips, but on my toes. It's kind of drying out. I have to go and get a new one. I've had this for a really long time, but it's that second one, obviously. But it pretty much dries the same color. Um, it lasts for a really long time. I've had this for probably about a year. I don't like wearing it on my fingertips. I like to have black and then a like greenish color. I just, that's my style. Um, but I don't think that this really goes very well with black, mainly because it reminds me of that song, Black and Yellow. I don't know. I just love this on my toes by itself. It's a wonderful, perfect color. Next from the Instant Dry Collection is Lively Lilac. Okay, I got that right. And it's this wonderful, like, purple color, and I've had this for, like, a really long time. I think it's gone bad. Let's test it out. I can barely get, like, I have to kind of, like, stir it up. Um, I haven't actually worn this color in a long time. But I loved using this on my fingertips and my toes. Actually, it still works pretty well. kind of works better than that lightning one. It's that nice purple color. I love that color. I think that it's really nice. And it's not like the NYC entire brand of nail polish seems to be really watery and not very pigmented like i put it on i have to put on like five coats for it to look like it actually worked so yeah okay so next we have and this is by sinful color and it's just like this awesome glittery one and it doesn't have a name i don't know if it's just glitter and people are supposed to see like oh it's glitter it doesn't have a name um, so, I don't know what the name of this is, the peeling, like, I can't read it. Uh, I don't see any name on it, but it is this awesome shimmery color. Let me do a swatch for you guys. And I typically don't even need two coats of this. that I didn't even need two coats for that I didn't even dip it back in there's just like one and other glitter ones that I've had it's just like you put on and you get like one or two pieces of glitter you keep on having to do it the next thing you know your nails are like so thick that they won't dry in a billion years so I just really like this when I do do glittery coats this is what I've always used so Next is my Revlon Color Stay in Sassy. I love using this on my toes and my fingers, and it's just this like wonderful spring green. When I saw it in the store, I was like, I have to get that. 
So let me do my little swatch thing. It dries really quickly, especially like with two coats. This is the last color right here. I absolutely love it. I love wearing this with black nail polish. Um, it doesn't really mix well with other colors. Sometimes it will mix with this Live in Lilac color. Not very much with other colors. I love using this on my toes, especially by itself. I don't really like to put black on my toes. I don't know. But I love using this with black on my fingernails. I think that makes an awesome combination. Yeah. Next, so I have like frizzes coming up. There we go. Okay, so next we have the long wearing nail thingy by NYC and it is the purple pizza frost and this is the like only NYC nail polish that I actually like and you still do have to put on a couple of coats but the first coat looks really good on the toes actually I had to dip it this one in twice there we go so here is the color and um, this is after like I put two little dips in it and I think that it's pretty good. I really only like this on my toes. Um, sometimes I can work it out on my fingers, mainly only with like a glitter taupe, taupe on top of it, coat on top of it. But um, yeah, so I just like this color. It's a nice really purple color. It's like a darker purple than this Live in Lilac color. I like both colors. I just don't like all of these, so yeah. Oh, and by the way, the black color that I use is by Pure Ice. And um, there, you guys can kind of see that. And um, I use this every single time I paint my nails. I always love to have black in my nails. I don't know, I just like black nail polish. Oh, and then also the coat that I use, the top coat that I use, is the Sally Hansen Hard as Nail, and so I'll just show you a little swap of it, just for like fun, since you guys won't be able to see it. And then I'll also show you a swap of the black one. This black one is like so pigmented, or I don't know if you use pigmented for nail polish, but it just is. I mean, like I only have to put on one coat of black. Here is the clear one, and then here is the black one, and here are all of my nail favorites. And if you guys like forgot the name of them, I will make sure to put all of the names of them in the description box. And um, yeah. So if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and save it to your favorites. And also, if you want to support my channel, make sure to subscribe, especially when I see more videos like this. And tell me what you guys want to see next by commenting down below, and maybe you guys can get my next video idea. And um, bye guys! Hey, say bye! Bye! The Ulta Dual Ended Pencil in Deep Brown.